All right. Today we're going to do a little bit of grooming with Jeannie. Um, I've got an Andis 2 AGC. I got a M40 blade for using different size combs. And I've got this wall adjustable here. This is what I use for close up. So we're going to start with this one. And we are going to give it a little oil here first. Always oil them. Give it a little wipe here. We're going to start with a quarter inch to do the body. Just like that. Put the trash can underneath here. And I am by no means a groomer. Uh, I've been grooming my own dogs now about two and a half, three years. We basically shave them down. They're mostly house dogs. Now we do live in Florida, so. Alright, so I'll go over their whole body with this quarter inch. And then I'll come back and I'll use an eighth inch to do the tops of her legs and blend in. And then I'll come back with a sixteenth of an inch and start and blend in the feet and the bottoms of the legs. And then I'll come back with this one and I'll do the feet real good underneath, up top. You can see Shih Tzu's have hair that constantly grows and it gets in their paws and they trap dirt and poopy and stuff everywhere and then I'll come and trim her eyes and her face and then blend her all in again so this is a before here and then when I'm done I'll do an after alright so now we've come along and blended all that in with the eighth inch. We're going to come with the sixteenth inch. And with this one here. And get these paws. You can see it looks like she's got. She's wearing socks. Get your head up, Jane. And I don't put any of my dogs on the choker. Um, I don't seem to need it. They behave pretty well. So we'll get that. All right, so now that we've gotten rid of the socks, we will uh, get this one here to close and take care of those feet and trim her face all up. So that's next. All right, why are you shaking? You can see we've got her face, got her feet, bottoms all clean. All that hair gone. So now we're going to finish up her head and then we're going to do her ears. See if they need to be plucked. They look pretty good. And we get the hair that's growing inside the ear. She's just got a little bit right there. Not too bad. Her ears look real clean. Uh, let me see if I can zoom that in. Does that work? Oh, there we go. So her ears look real clean. So, all right, 
We're going to finish you up. And we'll trim your nails too. Alright, so she's pretty much done now. Unless I see any spots that need a touch up anywhere. There's a little spot right there. Um, but next we're going to do her nails. Um, I always have the styptic powder out just in case. And then I use these ones here uh, when we have little puppies. I use these little ones for them. So we're going to do her nails. Fix a couple little spots like that and she'll be done. Alright, Miss Jeannie is done. I wanted to show you a little detail here. Zoom in here. Okay, so as you see from before, all the hair around her ears are shaved pretty much all underneath. So there's just a little bit here. That's a good girl. So there's just a little bit of hair right there to pluck. But you can see where all this is shaved under here now so the ear can get to her. Got her little nails clipped and I'll do them again next week. So she is done. I'm not going to do much to her ears, her tail. It's kind of thin. Her puppies just went home about a month ago and a lot of it was matted and had to be cut out. And she's a good girl. She's a good girl. All right, that's it. Jeannie is done. All pretty. Are you a pretty girl? Are you a pretty girl? Look at the camera. Look at the camera. Look at the camera. No?